a happy year 2018. It is my pleasure to send my warmest personal greetings and congratulations to the President, to the Vice President and to the people of Azerbaijan on celebrating the 100th anniversary on the Declaration of Independence of the Republic. 100 years ago, the flame of freedom was kindled in the hearts of a number of nations who all together are celebrating this year in commemoration of that date. The following years were not always kind to our nations and both the Second World War and even the interwar period brought heavy hardships, oppression and difficulties to the Azerbaijani people. We in Latvia sympathize with that sort of history because after our 20 years of independence we shared with Azerbaijan those long years of the existence and the submission to the Soviet Union. This is why we rejoice together with you on the recovery of our independence. I congratulate the people of Azerbaijan on the enormous progress they have accomplished in these past 26 years. The way the country has flourished, the way Baku has become a great metropolis at the world level, the way the country has been progressing against all odds and all sorts of difficulties. I wish the country to continue on its path to prosperity, peace, development, increased respect for the values that we hold dear in democracy, the spreading of higher education, the reputation of intellectuals and scientists from Azerbaijan all across the world. Happy anniversary, Azerbaijan. Our hearts are with you. years ago, Azerbaijan created the first democratic republic in the Muslim world that gave equal rights to women, way ahead of women having equal rights in voting in the United States and in other countries as well. It's my great uh, pleasure to wish uh, the Azerbaijani people for uh, the 100th anniversary of the independence of Azerbaijan as it is uh, our pleasure also to witness uh, uh, huge progress that uh, Azerbaijan has done in particular in uh, the last uh, two decades and in the last uh, years by being uh, very important uh, country which is uh, uh, going uh, to be also a very important uh, uh, partner for uh, Albania and for uh, our region and we are looking uh, forward to see this progress of uh, Azerbaijan to go on and uh, the leadership of uh, President uh, Aliyev and uh, at the same time uh, we uh, are confident that uh, our country-to-country -country relations, our people-to-people -people relations, our government-to-government -government, uh, relations will, uh, uh, will uh, uh, see, will have uh, new horizons, uh, in, uh, will reach new horizons uh, in the future. I want to congratulate to my friends in Azerbaijan uh, such a fantastic celebration, 100 years of beginning of Azerbaijani state. Nowadays, Azerbaijan is an independent country, prosperous country, country that has a brilliant future, and I'm totally sure that Azerbaijani's leaders and uh, Azerbaijani's people are going to achieve a lot in the near future. I am very proud because of participating in NGAC forum which is Azerbaijani international institution, think tank, that is contributing to the peace and stability all around the world. And I have to underline once again 
Azerbaijan nowadays is a prosperous country that is able even to found such important institutions like NGIC. To have a national state is a great privilege for every nation. 100 years of national state is something very special, a very special event. And I congratulate from the 100 years old Latvia, the 100 years old Azerbaijan, and wish many, many hundred years of prosperity and happiness for the Azerbaijani people. Дорогі азербайджанські народи, дорогі мої друзі, дорогі приятелі, я щиро вас вітаю із століттям Азербайджанської народної республіки. 1918 рік був роком, коли зовсім ненадовго Україна також здобула свою незалежність і однією з перших встановила дипломатичні стосунки з молодою Азербайджанською республікою. Україна разом із Азербайджаном проходила всі випробування, які несло ХХ століття. І сьогодні обидві наші країни потрапляють під зовнішній агресії і всіма силами прагнуть відновити свою територіальну цілісність і політичний суверенітет. Я дякую братньому азербайджанському народу за незмінну підтримку України на всіх рівнях – політичному, економічному, культурному та, на, за, та за прекрасні людські стосунки між нашими двома народами. Хочу також подякувати президенту Ільхаму Алію, моєму другу, за визначний особистий внесок в розбудову наших двосторонніх відносин. Я щиро бажаю азербайджанському народові процвітання, доброї долі, Добробуту та миру. Хай вам щастить. I would like to bless the president of Azerbaijan, his family, the Azari people, for their achievements. I see the country many times, I come many times, and I see always a very beautiful country with a great achievement. We, the Israelis, love very much this country and we wish you all the best for the future. I want to start with congratulating first centennial of the uh, Republic of Azerbaijan. Uh, you are much bigger than the size of the country. This centennial is much bigger than 100 years. This is about the history that is tracking go back and go back to the time of great Nizami Ganjali, uh, who was the symbol of something which we all needs today and needs in the future, which is tolerance, understanding, diversity, and working together for a shared future with a shared vision. With shared values, is a shared society, and Azerbaijan is example of diversities being united under one flag and one country, but trying to reach out and be the bridge, not in between the east and west, but be a bridge and helping to be others, helping others to make a bridges together, that the world tomorrow becomes much better than the world that is behind us. And, of course, uh, as uh, someone who is coming from Bosnia and Herzegovina, uh, we are people who are very thankful to President Aliyev, to Republic of Azerbaijan, and, after all, one of the first countries that accepted us and recognized us as full sovereign independent Bosnia and Herzegovina was your country. I'm coming from Sarajevo, that is sisters. It is with great pleasure that I want to congratulate our brotherly nation, 
with the centennial of the Republic. Already one century ago, Azerbaijan was at the forefront of global transformative processes. It was the first secular Muslim democracy, country who had at that time already engaged women in political processes. It is a pleasure to see the evolution and development of our brotherly nation. I wish further prosperity, economic development, and security for Azerbaijani people for more centuries to come in the future. Hello to my friends in Azerbaijan. I'm Ivo Josipovic, former president of the Republic of Croatia. I'm sitting here in Zagreb for the beautiful Lisinski Concert Hall, thinking about my friends in your country. You are celebrating 100 years of Democratic Republic of Azerbaijan, especially after new established independence, the development of your country is impressive. I like your country very much and I feel in Azerbaijan as at home. Hope that friendship between Croatia and Azerbaijan will, be, will develop further and of course all my friends from Azerbaijan are welcome in Croatia. I would like to greet all our dear friends in Azerbaijan on the occasion of the 100th anniversary of the Azerbaijan Democratic Republic. Generations of your heroes have dreamt, fought, and died for this tremendously important milestone in your nation's ancient, rich, and diverse history. I wish your wonderful country a prosperous future, and I wish your talented and hospitable people many more centuries of peace, happiness, and success. May our two countries, Azerbaijan and Ukraine, work together closely for a better future for all of us. Congratulations. Thank you.